Blake Jackson leading things off for the 49ers. And he fouls off the first. Jackson. Strike three on Jackson. Line drive. And Dragum's got a base hit here in the first. Here's Beams 2-2. Two -two. Yep. Throws Fisher and he knew it right there. And goes down swinging. And down goes Ohona. Here's Hunter Ensley. You would think there'd be an and he got clipped on the top of the shoe. He's got the data that can help him do it the way he wants to. It's two punch outs both on that fastball. Spoyar. To the left side, backhanded pickup by Dragum, and he goes to second to get the force. It's outside of San Bernardino, and he goes down looking. Strike on number four for Bean. Brother CJ was the 13th round pick of the Diamondbacks in 2014, and this ball's touched. Deep left center field, and Christian Moore's gone yard to give Tennessee a 1 0 lead. Big orange showing out today. There's an MVP of this regional. Christian Moore's name is going to be right at the top of that list after these last few days. He has been phenomenal. And there hadn't been a whole lot of good swings, and it's early off a of spoiler to this point. This was one of them. At about a third of the way up that scoreboard out in left center field, the ball strike first with a solo home run here in the second inning. Set the home run record last year in school history, and Spoiler. Bounces back with his third strikeout. This order exactly the way he wanted to. That's that's the good one. Fifth strikeout. So that'll put Jackson aboard with two down. First pitch, backhanded pickup by Denton. Lobs it across. Stark goes down swinging. It's strikeout number four for Spolier. Played perfectly by Austin Knight. Not a great throw, but Nolan there to help him. You want to hold the scuff the side that you wanted to move more, but sometimes it just gives you a little bit more grip. The seams fell off. Strike three on the breaking ball back door. It's a strikeout number seven for Drew Beam. Oh, hot shot, and it goes off the back of the glove of Nolan. And Dickey will reach to start the fourth. And that ball smoked into left field. That's a fair ball and a hop against the fence. Nice play by Jackson. Throw comes into third. And Griffin Merritt's got a double. Two in scoring position. Potter family is set. 2-2 two -two pitch. Well hit. Center field. Back goes Cunningham. And makes a catch on the run. This will get a run home as Dickey tags from third. Christian Moore is driven in a pair. Tennessee has a 2 0 lead in the fourth. And Burke sends it into center. Cunningham makes a catch. We'll get back to back sack flies. Rocky Top turns again. Good situational hitting by the balls. And really well. Deep center. Cunningham back. Denton's done it again off the batter's eye. Third home run in two games. Two of them last night. A three run shot that kept the game going. Now Zane Denton tonight just stays on a heater. 420 feet to center field, 104 miles an hour off the bat. And the Vols starting to come alive. Christian Scott with a fly ball to shallow left. And the shortstop handles it for the third out. 
Breaking ball well hit deep left field and that one's gone and a solo shot for Knight. His second against Tennessee this week for the former volunteer. Gilligan found it. That's how they got the scoring going in the opener today. This one's a hanger. That curveball been really good down the zone for most of it, but that one right in the middle of the plate. In fact, probably upper third of the zone. Austin Knight was sitting and waiting for us. Short hop the plate. They say he went. I got to throw down, and Stark will finish the strikeout. Big strikeout for Beam, his ninth. And it follows an inning where Austin Knight connected on his second home run against Tennessee this weekend. Lurking, he, you mismanaged the bullpen, and he's got a veteran in Frank Anderson. Wake's got nine nothing lead on George Mason in the third. Strike three for Ahona, and Sims has come in, filling up the strike zone. To third base, Stallman. One, two, three frame worked by Hale Sims. He would have been like a sophomore in high school. That would have been memorable. <laughs> Jackson with a base hit to start the sixth. All right. And this ball is lifted to left center field. Ensley. For the first out, tagging and heading to second is Jackson, and he goes in head first. And he sends a line drive down the right side. It's a fair ball. Blake Jackson around third. The throw lobbed into second. And it's a run scoring double for Cam Fisher. It's a part of the lineup that could do damage. Lead off single by Blake Jackson. Takes second on that fly ball to center. And that's where that play, this play is even more important. Because I don't think he's scoring from first base on this ball. But he's scoring easily from second. Just inside the line. Kind of a throwback offense. Swing and a miss for Cunningham. He's got a hat trick now. Andrew Beams got 10 strikeouts. 0 2 is a line drive into center field and a sliding catch made by Ensley. And this ball is launched towards left field and will get up against the fence and on that little berm. And another long single. He's one for one with a home run. Hold that. <laughs> Deep center field. And Mr. Brooklyn's done it again. Two run home run for Christian Moore. Dad Charles picked the right game to watch his son play in person for the first time. His uncle says, that's two. Our guy's got two of them. The guy's got four on the weekend. Yep, got that one. Got that one. Don't need that anymore. 426 feet, dead central. That was about 10 feet away from flying to batter's eye and sun. <laughs> it's probably a record. Fourth strikeout for Sims. And that'll get Charlotte off the field. He has struck out five. And a punch out. As valuable as Frank is, you would think Tony would take the bullet for him. Swing and a miss for Sewell. Back to back K's. 3 2. Good call off the plate. Yep. 2 2. And lined into right field. Long run for Scott up on the hill. It will get off the fence. Headed to third is Butcher. And diving into second with a two out double. Is Eli Wiesner. Strike three. Rolls it right through the middle, and Christian Scott with a leadoff single. Runner goes, pitches low and away. And an easy 90 for Christian Scott. Now a perfect 11 for 11. And that one gets through the left side. Scott around third. Elander will stop him there. 
First two have reached here in the seventh. Ahona is 0 for 3 today. To the shortstop, that'll get a run home. A kick in the bag and a throw over, and Ahuna is out at first base. I thought they may take a look at this. He's going to drive in a run regardless. Christian Scott from third base scores easily, extends that. Vols lead now out to five. I think he's safe. I think he's safe. Right down the middle for a strike. Two down. Up the middle. Smothered and stopped. What a play. And the throw from Dragon is in time. Draws a walk with one out. Good come back there. That's accurate. That one fits through the left side and a base hit for Stallman. Fisher around third. Strong throw from Dickey, and he is out at the plate. What a throw by Dickey. If it stands, it will end the inning. I got him safe. Uh, okay, here's the issue. Does, does the foot touch home plate? Watch the foot come up. It's, it's getting that front foot to touch home plate, and I don't think the front foot touched home plate. He beat the ball for sure. Missed upstairs with 96. Lead off walk from Langhorn. And things got right, but it rolled right out of the zone. Swing and a miss for Denton, and a big strikeout. It was lost for a moment by Hobson. That was all the time that Merritt and Moore needed to advance. Scott is one for three with a single and a run, and he will send that one to left. That'll get Merritt home. Moore racing in behind him. The throw home is cut off, and Tennessee adds another two. It's now a 9-2 volunteer lead. Looking to go to three and two neutral site. Stark wears it. Runners on the move and a pitch in the dirt. Double steal. Did he go? He did. And that'll get Charlotte off the field. Advanced past Charlotte. Here's Austin Knight. And he sends a line drive to center field. One pitch, one out. I mean, those numbers are insane. .98 ERA. Moore has got it. 2-2 Two -two pitch. Swing and a miss. And Tennessee's won another regional. It'll be the fifth straight Super Regional appearance for the Volunteers.